Quentin Tarantino has been an enigmatic figure in the years since he's been an active filmmaker. Tara Wood's new documentary, QT8, The First Eight, looks at the behind-the-scenes process of how the first eight of Tarantino's films were made. The documentary interviews people who've worked with Tarantino on these films, right from Jamie Foxx to Diane Kruger and Jennifer Jason Leigh, along with many of the executive producers and technicians who've collaborated with Tarantino from the start. One of the interviewed producers was Stacey Sher, who worked with Tarantino on Pulp Fiction, Django Unchained and The Hateful Eight. While talking about The Hateful Eight, Sher revealed that one of the characters in the film was actually inspired by Harvey Weinstein. John the Hangman Ruth, the character played by Kurt Russell, was apparently inspired by Weinstein's own predatory nature. Tarantino described John Ruth as a bounty hunter who brutalizes his female prisoner, Daisy Domergue. Cher said that the misogyny of the character was something that Tarantino borrowed from Weinstein. She also added that Kurt Russell's personality makes that trait hard to identify at first stake. If you read it on the page, it was a little more accurate. Kurt is the most charming person on the planet. Incidentally, The Hateful Eight was produced and distributed by the Weinstein Company, but apparently Weinstein had no idea that John Ruth was inspired by him. The Hateful Eight was also the last film that Tarantino made with the Weinstein Company. And that was back in 2015, which was two whole years before the Me Too allegations against Weinstein surfaced in 2017. The script for The Hateful Eight was written in 2013-2014, which leads us to believe that Tarantino had long-standing knowledge of Weinstein's predatory nature. Moreover, Tarantino's former girlfriend, Mira Sorvino, also told him that Weinstein had made an inappropriate pass at her. In an interview with the New York Times, post the Me Too allegations came forward, Tarantino came forward to say that he knew about Weinstein's behavior but didn't do enough to change things or stop it entirely. I knew enough to do more than I did. There was more to it than just the normal rumors, the normal gossip. It wasn't secondhand. I knew he did a couple of these things. I wish I had taken responsibility for what I heard. If I had done the work I should have done then, I would have had to not work with him. What I did was marginalize the incidents. Anything I say now will sound like a crappy excuse. I chalked it up to a 50s, 60s era image of a boss chasing a secretary around the desk. QT8, the first eight, releases on October 21st and will have its on-demand release on December 4th. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, be sure to check out all our other content too and don't forget to subscribe.